Welcome back to the channel and today's video is a review on the Squid Trainer. Today I want to do something different. Today I want to do an in-depth review on the Squid Trainer. It has been a long time in common, you know, but I got a, got a knife coming in the mail. Uh, it's called the Titan and I want to like, you know, I want to do a professional review of it. So I'm just like training to do a review by making a review on the Squid Trainer. The review will be cut up in four pieces with flipping in between them. The individual piece will be the unboxing and then the specs, the flippability, the tuning, company and customer support, and then the extra one is extra score slash special features. Um, these scores will be to up to 10 and I will score them with five as an average. If you watch Will Hirsch, you will kind of feel familiar with this format, but you know, I wanted to do it myself and uh, just try it out. So without further ado, just let's jump into the video. This is the boxing experience you'll get from Squid Industries. It's a dark red box with their elegant logo on it. If you get the inked version of any, of any knife, like black blades, you will get an elegant black box. But if you buy any metal trainer, you will get a black bag, carrying bag. I lost my carrying bag, so I'm substituting it for the Squiddy, but you will know that if you buy a black or even just a metal knife, you will get a black bag. And what you get in the box is a sticker. This, is, this isn't a sticker, this is like more like a pamphlet with warranty and things like that. Uh, but you get a sticker. Um, I used my sticker on this, it kind of broke, but this is, what, this is some kind of sticker you get. Maybe you get another, another one or other, but this is the sticker I got. And then to the knife. The knife. Obviously, I have used mine, and I've had it for a long time. I have been pushing this review because I didn't have a channel when I got it, so... Yes. Well, anyways, that's the... The kind of unboxing experience you, you get from Squid Industries. As for the Squid Trainer... The unboxing you get at Squid Industries, I'll give it a... Um, Six out of ten. It's nothing special, but it's a little bit higher than average because you because you get this carrying bag and you get this warranty pamphlet, and you do actually get some extra stuff like stickers. So I think it's like a six out of ten. The knife itself is a channel construction made of made out of. Um, 6061 T6511 aluminium, so it's not a high strength aluminium, but it is for the price average. Average, I think it's a 410 steel, so not the best steel, but not the worst either. And it's press fits and pins, which is way better than screw ins and pins. That's a nightmare. At least for one of at least for the like clone ballet songs with bad hardware. Now we move on to the flippability. This is one of the most easiest questions in my opinion to to answer. Because this ballet song is a uh, no nonsense do all ballet song. It's a neutral balance ballet song, and it's a bit heavier than most ballet songs, at uh, 4.6 ounces, so about 153 
grams so it's a little bit tiring but since it's a neutral feeling and it, the weight is dispersed through all the belly it doesn't feel heavy but it definitely is as for the tricks you can do almost everything on this knife and it feels smooth responsive and tactile I really like this flip of the knife, but it's subjective if you like neutral or not, but it is an ex an exceptional flipper. And for the price, if you like neutral, I couldn't recommend it more. Into some flipping segment. Cute. Now. As for the score of the flippability, I will give it an 8 out of 10. It can't be a 10 out of 10 because nothing can be a 10 out of 10 in my opinion, because there isn't a single belly sign that is both neutral and handled by that could satisfy everyone. So in my opinion, this gets the highest award that I could possibly give it. And right now it's an 8 out of 10 because I haven't flipped enough ballets to say if this is a 10 out of 10. So, but based on other people's reviews and what other people say about it, I can justify giving it an 8 out of 10. As for the tuning of this ballet song, I'll give it an 7 out of 10. I mean, it's okay. It's pretty much, you know, just tighten till it has swing and no tap, but it's really fiddly. You have to sit with it like a good five to 10 minutes if you're not really that, you know, experienced in the tuning. So it, it works to tune. And one other thing that makes it harder to tune is because this bell song is an only washer's bell song no bushings which means that it should lose its tolerance faster and it's a harder to tune but that's why i like squid industries because generally with the squid trainer it holds up i mean this is six months old and no tap so i mean it's possible to tune out but it's just harder that's why it's only get a 7 out of 10 in tuning because you do know you do have to know what you're doing to get a no tap experience that brings us on to the next last thing about this review and that's company and customer service I would say Squid Industry as a company first of all it's uh, one of the biggest mass producing Belson companies in the world I do believe um, whether if you like them or not, that's subjective and up to you. I like them. But do know if you message them with a problem, they will respond and they will help you. So in my opinion, that brings a lot of value to the table. I would want to give this an eight out of 10. It's not the absolute best. I mean, what I probably would give a 10 out of 10 is the company that I'm buying the, the new Balasan, the Titan from. That that company I could give a 10 out of 10 to. I, I don't have I don't have their knife, but their company value and customer support is amazing. I mean I DM'd that person on his uh, on his Instagram and he responds with in like one hour. And we have had a long conversation there on like the sound of the knife and everything to its performance and what color I wanted and things like that. So that is customer value. That's it. That is company value and, and customer support at its finest, in my opinion. 
I don't have the knife, so I shouldn't, like, you know, shout about it yet before I've tested the knife. But I think that that company, it's, do it's doing it right. But that could also be because it's a small company. While Squid Industry is a lot, a lot bigger. So yeah, that's why I'm only giving Squid Industry uh, an 8 out of 10. Which is good. I mean, it's 3 points over average. It's 2 points from perfect. So yeah. That's the scoring I would like to give on company and customer support. Well, that brings us to the end of the review. Uh, its total score uh, across all of these metrics is um, a 29 of 40 possible points, which is over average. 20 is average, which means 29 is like a seven or 10 across the whole ballet song which means it's well over average. So, <clears throat> the question pe some people may ask is, should you buy this Bella song? Hmm. I mean, I can't decide that for you, but I like the knife. It's a good knife. So I say this, if you can handle a bit more heft, a heavier knife, and if you like the design and also if you like neutral feeling bella songs then yeah i couldn't recommend something more than this i mean this is perfect if you only want this is perfect if you want a no nonsense neutral channel handle bella song from a company that's rebu that reputable you know that's um well known and will give you the easiest time with if there is a problem or if something happens you know then yeah squid industries um squid trainer it's the right ballet song for you then in that case this is the end of the review i hope you liked it if you did like it consider subscribe join our discord server and i see you in the next one Bye.